The Arts, 1101-1460. There was a period of consolidation and improvement in the arts. The sense of invention and creativity in the early Middle Ages was developed further and refined. During the Middle Ages, artistic creativity around the world was blossoming. Medieval arts and music had developed, refining the styles and techniques created in the previous 500 years. There were now grander institutions, such as the church, requiring artistic works, and there was a growing number of patrons, rich people, who bought works of art and sponsored artists. The arts of the Tang and Song in China reached new heights of refinement in the Yuan and Ming periods. Ceramic, literature, music, theater, landscape, painting, gardening, lacquerware, and sculpture were all, uh, they all flourished this time. In Japan, local styles replaced the imported Chinese styles which had been adopted earlier. In comparison, the Toltecs and the Aztecs took on and adapted earlier styles from Teotihuacan and the Maya. Islamic art, now a long-standing tradition, was modernized by different schools of thought in Spain, Morocco, Egypt, and Samarkarland. Samar Samarkland. Ugh. In Europe, most art and music was created for the church, including stained glass, tapestry, and choral music. During the 1300s and 1400s, some artists working privately began to paint pictures in a realistic style. In Europe, there were mystery plays based on the Bible or on traditional myths or poems about heroes such as Charlemagne or King Arthur. George or Jerry Jeffrey Chaussier, Chaussier uh, wrote a book on courtly love and ordinary people. Books were available to a wider public as they began to be written in local languages rather than Latin.